Well, Corey, where did that one get away from you today? Uh, uh, it's a frustrating one because, to be fair, we've created a lot of chances and on another day, the players we've got, uh, we would have scored three or four, but it just weren't going in for us today. But um, I mean, we've pinned them back for the whole second half and uh, it's probably quite equal first half. They had a, a little session where they scored. But I mean, on another day, I think we could have easily won the game. Was it one of those where the first goal was always going to be crucial? Yeah, I don't even think that, to be fair. I think they scored the first goal, but it, it, to be honest, I think if one of them go, if one of them chances went in for us, yeah. we would have gone on to, to score three or four. Like We would have scored... We, we would have won the game in my eyes if it, it, it don't matter who got the first goal. If, if we would have got the goal, we would have won. You spoke about Preston's resilience and experience in the build-up to the game. I yeah. Mean, if you get your noses in front, how much is it a different game? For well, they them? are more experienced than us. You know, I mean, I wouldn't want to bring that one up, but you've asked me the question. They're they're far more experienced team than we are, and you know, just we we've made a little bit of a mistake on the goal. I don't want to single people out, but we've made a mistake on the goal. But that's what's going to happen with young players. And we've got young players, whether we like it or not, we've got young players. Um, and today's team would have been younger than normal with not having Wade Elliott available. So we've got a young team, but a young team that they're great. They're great to work with every day. And that's what we do. We carry on working and we still try and gain the position where we can be in to try and win.